Hi students, welcome to GSR Mass Academy. Now we are going to discuss about the third problem of exercise 7.2. Let us read a question. Find the ratio in which the line segment joining the points minus 3 comma 10 and 6 comma minus 8 is divided by minus 1 comma 6. That means what we need to find out? We need to find out that in which ratio this point minus 1 comma 6 divides the line segment joining the minus 3 comma 10 and uh, 6 comma minus 8 that means if you join these two points minus 3 comma 10 and 6 comma minus 8 you will get a, a line segment and uh, this line segment on this line segment if you take minus 1 comma 6 is a point in which ratio this point divides this line segment that we need to find out for that let us suppose a given points as a a as a minus 3 comma 10 and b as a 3 comma minus sorry 6 comma minus 8 and let us suppose point p is a minus 1 comma 6 so let me write the solution part let point a as a minus 3 comma 10 and b as a 6 comma minus 8 and point p is given as a minus 1 comma 6 okay so what we need to find out we need to find out the ratio that means in which ratio this point p divides this line segment a b that we need to find out as of now we don't know that in which ratio it divides so what i what we are going to suppose we are going to suppose that required ratio as a k is to one okay let point p minus one comma six divides a b line segment in the ratio of k is to 1 so by using section formula by using section formula we get the coordinates of the point p x comma y will be obtained by m x 2 plus n x 1 by m plus 1 m plus n and m y 2 plus n y 1 by n plus n okay so this is a section formula that means here m means what nana k and n means 1 and x1 is minus 3 y1 is 10 and uh, x2 is 6 and uh, y2 is minus set for the sake of convenience let us write that m is equal to k and n is equal to 1 then x1 is minus 3 y1 is 10 x2 is a 6 y2 is minus 8 so and we already know the point coordinates of the point p as minus 1 comma 6 so minus 1 comma 6 is equal to m means what nana k k into x2 is 6 plus 1 into minus 3 by k plus 1 and in the same manner k into minus 8 plus 1 into 10 by k plus 1 now you get as a minus 1 comma 6 which is equal to 6k minus 3 by k plus 1 and minus 8k plus 10 by k plus 1 now on uh, equating the x coordinates you are going to get the k value so if two order pairs are equal, if order pair A comma B is equal to P comma Q, if you sub, if they have given means, that means that first coordinates of these two are equal and second coordinates are equal. That means when these two order pairs are equal, means if our first coordinates are equal and second coordinates are equal. So on equating the first coordinates, you will get minus one is equal to six k minus three by k plus one and transporting this denominator to other hand you can get it as a minus 1 into k minus k minus 1 into plus 1 that is minus 1 is equal to 6k minus 3 and transporting this k to other hand minus k to other hand it becomes a pass 2 and transporting this power negative 2 3 to other hand it becomes pass 2 now minus 1 plus 3 is equal to 6k plus k from this you can write it as an 7k is equal to 2 then k is equal to 2 by 7 we got a k value as in 2 by 7 now what we have to find out we need to find out a ratio what we suppose that ratio as a k is to 1 so the required ratio 
therefore required ratio k is to 1 which is equal to 2 by 7 is to 1 2 by 7 is to 1 can be written as 2 is to 7 that means point p minus 1 comma 6 divides a line segment a minus 3 comma 10 and uh, 6 b 6 comma 8 in the ratio of 2 is to 7 thanks for watching please subscribe my channel and like share